idea on gender. Do we want to know, Gary, or do you want to wait? It's up to you. It's not a, always 100% on today's scan. Um, the best time to tell, uh, you know, 100% is at the your next ultrasound, which is between 18 and 20 weeks. Um, but I think I can get a pretty accurate idea today if you're interested in knowing. What do you think, Gary? It's up to you. It's up to you guys. Do you want to know, Gary? I'd rather know. Okay, Gary wants to know. What do you think? Based on what um, Gary and Kim, it looks like this is a baby boy. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> so what we do is we look at the tissue developing into the genitalia. Um, so we look at the, to see whether it's vertical or more horizontal. And consistently the tissue that we're evaluating today on your baby looks very um, vertical to me, which is almost always indicative of a little boy. But we don't know for sure. So, um, not for sure, but I'd be extremely surprised My if, baby you came surprised. Back, if you came back and it was not a boy. Okay, we'll see. We'll see. So, definitely feeling very confident. Hi. <laughs> no, he's just showing off. I love watching him wiggle. They're so soft. Can't, he can't, like, spin around. He just wiggles, right? Uh, no, they can just listen. No, look, he's looking at you now. can do complete somersaults and, and flip around at this point because there's a lot of space. Is the ultrasound triggering him moving or mostly? No. no? It's all, it's a lot. I of told you, I felt it the other day. I know they say you can't feel it yet, but I, well, I feel fluttery feelings. I'm very sensitive. Oh, wow, look at that. Yeah, now you know why I'm so tired. <laughs> I'm like, oh, I did something I want to look at now. I found the most comfortable position to sleep and I'm so excited. 